A2. Uh, please use the Zoom hand raise function and then we will call on you. Let us begin with Strafe Esports. Uh, hi, guys. First of all, I would like to say sorry for the loss. Um, this question okay. is for uh, this question is for all of the players and the coach. So you guys pick G2 for the first uh, for this matchup in the playoffs. So I would like to know what was the thought process behind that pick and also were there any expectations you had from the match that were or were not met from this matchup? Um, I mean, there wasn't really much talk into it. We just thought that we had a good game against them. Turns out that they are really, really good, and it was a bit difficult for us. But expectation wise, I mean, we expect to play better, pretty much. All right, thank you. Thank you. We'll go to Sports Kita next. Yes, uh, conversations on the loss. My question is for Alex. Uh, while the first two maps had their fair share of ups and downs, the third one ended up feeling a lot more one-sided and somewhat unsynchronized at times. What do you think allowed for G2 to have such a dominant hold on Bind specifically? I think you just couldn't stop them, you know? Like, um, the combo of utility... Uh, they execute and we couldn't stop the entrances. We were losing our gunfights. You know, when this happens, you know, nothing much you can do. I think we overrated a bit too much. We we didn't play our game as well as we can, and it shows in the scoreline. Thank you, and good luck on your next match. Thank you. Thank you. We'll go back to Strafe Esports for the next question. Uh, hi. This question is for Jing. So now that you've been back in the team, how and obviously this match didn't go as expected for you guys, but how does it feel to be back on the international stage once again? I mean, it definitely feels great to be back on stage because I haven't played for really long. So yeah, I mean, it was a really fun game. Thank you. Okay. We'll now take any questions from the room. I have two questions. The first question goes for Jean. As a crazy race player after the weekend of race, do you think it will affect you a lot or you prefer to try more different agents? I mean, I have to see what like the, what you're going to do to race first and see if it's still viable. If it's not viable, then I have to play other stuff. Okay, the second one is for something. From high sense to now, what click on you made the change? Uh... More consistency when I play on uh, land tournaments. Thank you. We have a question from Pedro. We'll go to Pedro next. Hey guys, uh, likewise, commiserations are on the series. So I got a question for uh, Forsaken. Going a little bit off of what Alex said regarding the team's issues against G2. Um, in the server, uh, what was your impression of? Uh, your opponent and also uh, what was the biggest challenge for you in terms of just facing them and everything that they brought to the table uh, I mean I think Alex just told me like just play your game and then just like try to focus on your on your aim first rather than like your utility maybe he has a good plan um, I think about G2 I think for them I think I would say they really um sharp I think Especially like on map bind, we don't have like momentum to beat them. They they have like a good strategy, I would say. All the utility like on point today. So yeah. Uh, we'll go to straight esports. It seems they have one more question. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this is the final question from my side. So your upcoming matchup would be against either EDG or Team Heretic. So this question is for all the players and the coach. Which which team from the two would you be willing to face in the next matchup? And do you have any expectations from that as well? I think personally for me, I would love to play EDG, I guess. We did it us last time and now we have a chance to meet them again. But obviously, Heretic is fine as well. But yeah, I mean, I would love to play EDG. And yeah, hopefully we able to be ourselves again for the next match. And yeah. All right. Good. Thank you very much. And all the best for your upcoming matchup. Thank you. Uh, we have one more question from Grill News. Go ahead. 
Thank you. Uh, my name is Estefiki. Unfortunately, you didn't have a good performance against the other team today. What do you think was the most difficult obstacle you faced today? Probably, I think when it comes to us, it's always about the aim, I guess. I guess it wasn't there. And also our team work not as good, I would say, in Bind. I mean, overall, they beat us. Obviously, like what Fosek mentioned, like they have a very good aim. And also, I think their teamwork was very, very good compared to us. So I think that's the reason why we are not ourselves today. But yeah, I mean, overall, it was a tough match, I would say. Thank you. Hey, Parax, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with Thank us you. today. Thank you. Thank you.